What is going on, guys? My name is my kid, Mars Marks, King King. Ah, so they're back with the video, and uh, well, I kind of came across this uh, saying this guy saying like, why would we not be getting a Demon Slayer movie in 2021? I, I kind of caught my interest. So, you know, I'm like, wait, what? What you mean by that, bruh? What you mean we not getting a Demon Slayer movie, my EG? So I'm kind of curious here. Um, so we'll see. I'll check something out really quick. I'll do that later. But um. So after the light right there, the lights keep switching. It's about to go out. I don't know, dog. I don't know. But anyway, guys, let's just see. Let's see what we got going on. Let's see what we got going on here. Got the JoJo hoodie. Yeah, right now we shrocking. Now, I don't know about you guys, but personally for me, it's getting more and more annoying to see Crunchyroll post every week on all of their social media platforms more news about how amazing the Demon Slayer movie is doing when they know that 99% of the Western anime fans following their accounts cannot watch the movie. Yeah, and bro. I'm certain everybody who clicked this video understands how just smashingly successful the Demon Slayer movie has Over been. Over Japan, out, dog? Yeah, he outsold Spirited Away at the box office during a global pandemic, which is an absolutely shocking and unexpected feat in my It must opinion. be that, yo, it, yo, Demon, Demon Slayer, Slayer movie, which is just a continuation it's of the there. 24 episodes we've already had adapted, would do this well. Now, among Crunchyroll's 15 million other tweets regarding the Demon Slayer Mugen Train movie, it seems like we've gotten one that might explain just why we have not seen it released in the West. So, Crunchyroll yeah, we, yeah I noticed today, that. Yeah, February no release 23rd, movie coming that out the West. Demon Slayer Mugen Train gets Oscar qualifying run in Miami from February 26th for one week. So this is officially the first instance that we've seen the Demon Slayer movie released in the United States. However, you're not going to be able to watch it, even if you live in Miami, and let me explain to you why. What? So, in the expanding article, which is titled Just What I Said in the Tweet, Japan News Network reported today that the long-awaited North American screenings of Demon Slayer Kimetsu no Yeba, the movie Mugen Train, will be starting for a limited time on February 26th. Yeah, These probably not even that long. will be held for one week in just the city of Miami to help the anime film qualify for this year's Academy Awards, of which the film is already in selection. It just needed to be released publicly, either online or through traditional means, for at least a week. So you heard it there, folks. The only reason that we're getting the movie in the United States at all is because in order to qualify for the Oscar Academy Awards, which is the biggest film awards in the entire yeah, world. Yeah, that's huge. World, that's huge, bro. The they Oscars? have to release it for a week. And not only do they just have to release so it they're just for doing a week, this. That, that wasn't their own. So they're just doing this just so they can get so they can get a freaking Oscar? Damn. You can forget it. Hey, guys. We had a good run. Have a good night. <laughs> No, we ain't gonna see this junk right here. We ain't gonna see it, my G. We ain't gonna see it, bro. It is. I mean, it is what it is. At the end of the day, ain't nothing we can do about it. I mean, oh, we got. Uh, ain't nothing we can do. Let me try my. I mean, it is what it is. At the end of the day, but it's, it's nothing we can do about it. So you know, only option was to screen it in Miami for a week. No, they could actually publicly release it online through a streaming service yeah, such as to go all and that. still be able to enter into the academy awards now of course they didn't do that as it says here that those screenings were just for the academy awards and that a full theatrical release is still in the works now the film we is going to in australia in over here Zealand, like on years, february here. 25th which is two days from the time i am recording this video now, the Demon Slayer movie at the box office has already made a whopping $400 million, which is only in Japan, keep in mind. Ah, and yeah. That is on a whole nother level yeah. of absurdity when it comes to any film, whether that be anime or Hollywood. Keep that in mind, bro. For an anime film? Bruh. This so this film is doing better than movies you see in like Hollywood for like guys like but let's just like maybe Tom Cruise, Jason Statham, bruh. Hold that, that's yo that's that's good, that's good. Cause think about it, Hollywood movies. I say they probably get like what well, five hundred, six hundred million box office. Certain like certain movies, I'm so, if it's like fat, not, it's from like Fast and the Furious or something like that, which get. Which goes over a lot, but I'm talking about you know your typical you know Hollywood movies and everything. 
you know, like just like a, a random Hollywood movie that comes out with famous actors, bro. Like, yo, this is an anime movie, bro. Like, yo, that's big moves. You know, us anime fans, bro. Us anime fans, bro. Like, yo, we get in there, bro. We, we, you feel me? I don't know. Y'all can't see my tattoo, but we get in there, man. Like, we, it's something. Cause, bro, I remember back way back when, like, yo, you, like, you, you can. I remember you couldn't probably couldn't even dream or imagine something like that even happening. So the fact that this is happening, and it's, just, it's, yeah, yeah, honestly, it's in Japan, but, dog. We knock it on the door. But yet, here they are releasing it for only a week in Miami, and not for the purpose of giving fans a week to go see the movie subbed. No, 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 no. This is because they need to qualify for the Oscar awards, yeah, they, as they I've don't mentioned. Care. They don't now, care. this is annoying because we know the film is complete. It's being released in Australia and New Zealand in two days in a subtitled form. This meaning there's really no work needed to be done for a full theatrical release, as they claim. This meaning that, yes, the only reason the Demon Slayer film has not been released worldwide, or at least in the United States, is because of money. Even though they've already made a record amount. Take into consideration that if they were to release the Demon Slayer Mugen Train movie on Crunchyroll, for example, for let's say a week time so they could qualify for the Academy Awards, they know that 90% of the people who want to watch the movie would take that opportunity to then watch the movie. Yeah. On he's right, he's you right, You would have he's less right. people buy tickets to the movie theater, right? Which yeah. means less profit. Now, I understand because of COVID why they wouldn't run or release it in... American theaters. Yeah, because, I mean, bro, the, the, bro with the design. pandemic and everything that's going on, I don't even think, like, up here, I don't even, I, I haven't been, I haven't seen a movie in, like, what? I, had, I think the last time I actually sat down and seen a movie was Endgame. I think Endgame was the last time I sat down and watched a full course. Yeah, it was Avengers Endgame. That was the last time I saw, sat down and watched a full course movie. So it's been, like, two years, almost two years since I sat in a movie theater, dog. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, yo. So, they don't want to risk it, because, like, you would read that joint worldwide, and everybody can't see it. How is that helping the situation out? So, I guess over at Miami... Esther, quite terribly, and we're one of the countries that leads in cases. So, I could understand not wanting to do a theatrical release. However, one of the most greedy, money-hungry companies in the world, Disney, <laughs> is still doing digital releases for many of their original shows and yeah. movies. So I wonder why Demon Slayer cannot do the same. And this also comes after the announcement that they Demon different. Slayer Season 2, which takes place after the events of the movie, is going to be released this year. It's meaning that by the end of 2021, Japan will be multiple arcs ahead of the Western fans, and for no reason other than the fact that they need money from the theaters. And they don't need money, they want money. <laughs> so, ultimately, until yeah, the COVID-19 pandemic is over, or at a reasonable level in the United States, we will not be seeing the Demon Slayer Mugen Train movie, as it has already been proven that UFO Table does not want to release the movie unless they can do a full theatrical release, which at the time is not possible because of COVID. Now, as I've said, they could easily do a digital release, but they're not going to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So There's if you're no sitting here wondering why your Twitter they, they feed is full point. of what? Demon Slayer news that you as a Demon Slayer or anime fan is missing out on, you can blame money. And while Crunchyroll claims to give you anime at the speed of Japan, that clearly is not the case. There is no reason other than greed as to why be released subtitled right now and i know for a fact that those who want to watch it dubbed in movie theaters they could get that done within a reasonable time span as well and while i'm understanding of the COVID implications this is just absolutely ridiculous and there's no reason why this movie shouldn't be out in the united states and if you think otherwise you're simply making excuses for companies being greedy so please crunchyroll do us all a favor and quit posting about the demon slayer movie because we're tired of not being able to see it. Look at yeah, it. Yeah, it's Everybody not fair. is I exhausted it. that we have to hear about how amazing this movie is and that we're not able to access it simply because UFO Table wants to be greedy. Rant over. Goodbye. Good night. Have a great rest of your day. Hey, man. I, see you. I respect that, man. Tech, I respect that, man. I don't know how it is, bro. I don't know how it is. I mean, it's not fair.
I mean, because, like, like I said, in doing the whole co- the pandemic and everything, our theaters aren't even open. So, it's like, eh, it's kind of, why would he even want to do, it'd be kind of, I guess, over at, up in Miami, theaters are open, I guess. I don't know, man. But then, I, I agree, because I do see Crunchyroll posting, like, yo, like, Demon Slayer, how much box office scores they got, I mean, how much money they made in box office, all that surpassed 300 million, 200 million. I used to go, you can see that on their Twitter page, their community tab, and freaking YouTube. Right, it's crazy on Instagram. Like it's all over the place, man. They do, they are posting that a lot. But excuse me, and it's not fair. Like you know, I mean, I want to see. I'm a Demon Slayer fan. I like Demon Slayer. You know what I'm saying? I ain't like a hardcore fan because I didn't, I didn't, I didn't read the manga. I just watched the anime. But I, I understand. I understand where tech is coming from. But yeah, man. I mean, it is what it is at this point, man. I'm not even going to trip it by. At first, I was all like, yo. But forget it, man. It's chilling. We living. We here. But. I don't know, bro. Anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Um, I'm going to edit this video and everything, and I'm going to move on to the next one. Um, so, apparently, somebody made a, an Avatar The Last Airbender anime opening. I really want to look that, look at that. So, that'll be the last video of the day. And, uh, yeah. All right, guys. Uh, stay safe, stay fresh. Boy, boy mth one k Miles Marks, a.k.a. King Marks. And I'll see you guys in the next video. And, uh, yeah. Bye, Z, the anime bad boy. Out this bitch. All right.